Let's review exponents. I'm going to start from the general formulas. The very first formula says any time we have numbers or variables with the same base, we're supposed to keep the base and add exponents. For example, I have x to the second power times x to the third power. According to the rule, I have to keep the base. My base is x and I have to add exponents. 2 plus 3. Where 2 plus 3 is equal 5. My answer is x to the fifth power. Next formula is for power of the power. Any time we have exponent inside of the parentheses and exponent outside of the parentheses, we're supposed to keep the base and multiply exponents. For example, I have x to the second power and everything is raised to the third power. According to the rule, we have to keep the base and multiply exponents. I have 2 times 3. My answer is x to the sixth power. Next formula is for division. Formula for division says that Anytime we have the same base, we're supposed to keep the base and subtract exponents. Right? So we have, let's say, example x to the fifth over x to the third. According to the rule, I'm supposed to keep the base. In this case, my base is x and I'm supposed to subtract exponents. So I have 5 minus 3. Answer is x to the second power. Very simple. Another condition is when we have exponent in the denominator greater than the exponent in the numerator. So for example, I have x to the third power in the numerator and we have x to the fifth power in the, in the denominator. Right? According to the rule, if the base is the same, right? I keep the base, but this base has to be placed in the denominator and I'm supposed to subtract exponents, right? But starting from the bottom one. In other words, my answer is 1 over x 5 minus 3 and my answer is going to be x 1 over x to the second power very simple next formula is for negative exponent anytime we have term with negative exponent we're supposed to bring that term to the denominator and negative exponent convert to positive. Example, x to negative second power is going to be nothing else, just 1 over x to the second power. Very simple.